if you have ever incubated fertilized eggs as a farmer i know that you have experienced some eggs not hatching and you know that you incubated fertilized eggs so this might happen due to contamination of bacteria through the hands you know through the incubator and through a hen if you are doing natural incubation and i'm going to show you how we can reduce the bacteria on the egg shell by using vinegar vinegar when used or when sprayed on fertilized eggs is going to disinfect and sanitize the eggs to increase their chances of hatching so if you are getting a 60 percent hatching percentage now we are going to increase that by 50 percent and somehow get 80 to 85 percent when you hatch fertilized eggs the acidity of the vinegar is going to kill the harmful bacteria and the germs that are usually present on the egg which may otherwise reduce the hatching rate or cause the death of the embryos which might be developing inside the egg shell during incubation also vinegar can help reduce the risk of bacteria infection in the chicks once they hatched so it's going to kill any bacteria that may be transferred through the eggshell and this will lead to a chick which may hatch and become more resilient and more likely to thrive and reach their full potential in terms of weight gain and in terms of in terms of being able to produce more eggs therefore i am going to show you the results once these eggs was sprayed with vinegar what happened to the eggs and what happened to the chicks after they hatched also i'm going to show, show you how to prepare the vinegar solution into the required percentage or concentration also i'm going to show you some precautions that you should know before trying to use vinegar on fertilized eggs and before we get into the video please subscribe to this channel like this video and tell me any question that you have and you can join my telegram channel whereby we share information and interact with farmers so these are the results of the experiment when spraying vinegar on fertilized eggs and we have several parameters that we are going to check and we have two groups of fertilized eggs we have the control when nothing was sprayed and when the vinegar was sprayed and in terms of embryonic length of the on the 18th day the body length of the control was 11 centimeters well that one for fertilized eggs was 13 centimeters you've seen that vinegar is increasing the growth of the chicken in terms of body length also the shank length you're seeing that there's an increase in the shank length when vinegar was sprayed on fertilized eggs so in terms of chick when the chick hatched you're going to check on these parameters body weight body weight the one that were not sprayed with vinegar were 32 grams when the ones were sprayed with vinegar were 35 grams so they see, see that once the chick hatched there's a there's a clear view that the ones were that were sprayed with vinegar are much more heavier and the archability this is you no know, this is the most interesting part is that they, we had a 78 percent hatching percentage while the ones which are sprayed with vinegar had 87 so this an almost increase of 10 percent almost we have an almost 90 percent hatching percentage now in terms of embryonic you know mortality that is death so 21 percent of the eggs or rather the fertilized eggs died you know the the, the embryo died well just 12 percent you know so this is vinegar is reducing the amount you know the percentage of death of the chicks and that is gotten from minus in 100 percent minus touch ability that's how we are getting this the mortality embryonic percentage the hatching time now this is the most interesting part when the ones which are not spread with vinegar they hatched longer by five or eight five or four hours hours while the ones which are spread with vinegar had a much more faster hatching and they, you know they hatched with almost six hours earlier how are we going to prepare this vinegar to the required concentration percentage of 2.5 percent vinegar solution let us get a look on how to prepare vinegar solution first you're going to go to the market and then you're going to buy vinegar 
and this is specifically the white vinegar and then for example you buy five percent vinegar concentration and for us we need a vinegar concentration of 2.5 so that we can spray it on our fertilized eggs so in order to in order to convert this into 2.5 percent vinegar concentration we are going to take a part of the 5 percent vinegar concentration that let's say we are going to take 100 ml of the vinegar and then we are going to take 100 ml of water and you see these are equal parts so it's like you're it's like we are diluting this 5 percent by half and that will help us make a 2.5 vinegar concentration 1 ml 100 ml vinegar and 100 ml water and you're going to put it in our spray and for sure this will be 2.5 vinegar concentration and if for example you're going to get a vinegar concentration which is which is not five percent you can comment below the vinegar concentration and i'll make for you how you're going to dilute it with water so what are some of the precautions that we should follow when preparing this vinegar for our father's eggs the first precautions is that you should try and avoid the risk of using this vinegar with other type of treatments so for example if you are doing this you know it is not recommended that you mix you know maybe you can be mixing something else like alcohol like other vinegar because all of this are, are, can be used to sanitize the eggshell if you're going to use one thing use it use vinegar use vinegar don't try and, and mix some things up and that may affect the hatching percentage or even the chick itself the other thing is that avoid over application you know spraying like 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 you're dipping the eggs into white vinegar just spray you know sparingly don't spray too much of the vinegar because this may may lead to damaging the eggshell or corroding the eggshell because excess vinegar which is acidic will erode the shell and that will reduce the concentration or the hatching percentage of your eggs also vinegar you, 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 we've heard that vinegar is, is an acidic solution and if you're going to buy like most acidic like 100 percent vinegar concentration that may load or may affect your hands so when handling this high percentage high percentage of vinegar try to protect yourself protect your hands wear some protective gloves protect your eyes so that so that you can prevent the splashes of the vinegar and this will help you keep safe while practicing better farming practices so i hope that this video has empowered you and you can click on the video on the screen right now to go and learn how mango leaves is a better drug compared to the antibiotics that are usually given to chickens